Hey guys, welcome to or back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing y'all my pearly bead collection and organization for them. Um, so I have a cart with all of my stuff in the corner of my room. So before we get started, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. Okay, let's get started. So as you can see over here in the corner of my room, I have a cart and then a toolbox. So I have some stuff for my pearly beads, pearl beads, and then my pearl beads sorted in there. So I'm gonna start with the top of my shelf. So right here, I have two pegboards. I have this design book, and then I have these two little design books that came with my new beads. So I have that right there. I got um, this book and these boards at Michael's and then I have on top of my little organizer my pearly bead tweezers I also got these from Michael's and then in here I have just some different things that I've made and then in here I have some parchment paper and um, instructions and then I have this little organizer that I got from Target in the dollar section and then right here I have my mini iron so this is what it looks like. It is pink and has a little smiley face on the front. I love it. It gets up to 180 Celsius degrees. And then right here I have the little charger, or I mean the like cord that it comes with. You just flip the switch on and a little light will turn on telling you that it's on. And you wait about a minute and then it'll heat up. My iron came with this little watermelon heat mat that you set the iron on when it's hot. It also came with this like mesh mat that you put over like your ironing to like we'll use instead of parchment paper. So I will try to link the iron in my description. And then that's all for the top. And now for the middle. So right here I have my assorted 11,000 count of pearly beads. I got this at Michaels. And then right here, um, for some reason I decided to keep the trays that my pearler beads came in. So that's on there. And then I got this henna kit for Christmas. You would know if you watched my, um, what I got for Christmas video, make sure to go check that out. But I got this henna kit. Um, I got it at Walmart, it was $10. I'm super excited to try it. But, um, that, oh, I will also link the pearler beads that I get, which I will show you in a second. Um, try to link those in my description as well. But that is everything for the middle section. So now we're going to move on to the bottom. So right here, I have this tie-dye kit that my aunt bought me for Christmas. I'm just going to show you briefly what's in it. So this is two different kits that I put together. So... It came with this beach bag that says, love who you are. It's got like mesh at the top. I thought it would be a good beach bag. So that is probably what I'm going to use it for. So that came in the bucket pack. And then the bucket also came with um, rubber bands and gloves. And then it came with three small bottles of yellow, blue, and pink dye. Um, so that's everything that came in the bucket. And then I got a second kit that I just added it into here. Came with gloves, rubber bands, and then this little patch. I'm not sure, I think it's like vinyl, might be sticky. I'm not really sure how to attach it, but it's in the instructions. But the second kit is meant for t-shirts. You put that on the t-shirt after you tie-dye it. And then the second kit came with three larger bottles of pink, blue, and yellow dye. So that is everything in that tie dye kit and then right here i also have this organizer um that is here temporarily until i get a desk for my room but that's all for my cart so now i'm going to show you all of my pearly beads so let's go ahead and do that so Right here, I have red. They're both the same color. I will combine them. I just haven't yet. But I have red, orange, golden yellow, yellow, 
cream. I have this um, dark blue and then this like lighter blue. And then I have two different teal colors. One's darker, one's lighter. And the way I organize this is I made the darker colors first and then the lighter in rainbow order. And then I have all this special beads below it. And then I have this pinkish purple, or this pink purple color, this dark neon pink, and then this lighter neon, uh, neon pink. And then I have this tan brown color. I have black, white, and then these are my special colors. So I have black and white stripe, um, orange and red, light green, dark green, baby blue, dark blue, or like neon kind of blue. Um, light purple, dark purple, and then neon pink, baby pink. And I'm super excited for these two colors. They're super pretty together. And I think I'm going to do a cotton candy type, um, like, project with these. And then these are my metallics. So those are all um, multicolor stripes, and these are metallics. So I have this pretty dark pink metallic color. And then this beautiful color that reminds me of silk robes, or like a bridal robe. But... Yes, I have that color. And then I have yellow metallic. I have this darkish, like tealish green color metallic. And then this like, teal um, metallic. And then I have this purple that is glittery. And then I have, sorry, got my dirty feet. I've been outside. Oh, <laughs> I pulled the wrong door out. But I've been outside a lot today. Um, and you can't tell on camera that well. But this silver is also glittery. And then I plan to fill this up with everything that I make. They're in a separate bucket right now. I need to transfer them. But yes, these are all of my pearly beads. And I love them. And I plan to get some more pegboard soon. But... That is all. So this is everything um, of my pearly beads. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it and showing you my pearly bead collection. Um, but don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.